Hey guys, it is monthly favourites time, but I thought I would do something a little bit different and I would do some of my favourite things. So just a few things that I like in my life, just so you guys can get to know me a little bit more. So here we are, these are a few of my favourite things. One of the things that is a huge part of my life is animals. I've always loved animals since I was a little girl up until now and I'm very lucky to have my dream job and I'm actually working with animals, uh, in particular Australian native wildlife. So I do really, really love animals. It is one of my favourite things to do. My favourite animal of all time is elephants and I have been overseas and volunteered at an elephant nature park before um, and that was an amazing experience and I cannot wait to go back. I have been back a few times and definitely want to do it again. I also love my cat and dog. If you saw my Just a Dog video, I will leave the link to the, that video below. Um, that is my dog Leo. I love him loads. Same with my cat. They just make my life complete and I couldn't imagine my life without them. Now my favourite movies are Disney movies and yes I'm 26 years old but I'm still a kid at heart and I've always loved Disney. Uh, my favourite Disney movies are The Lion King because it was the very first Disney movie I ever owned and my next favourite is Beauty and the Beast which I've always loved and I loosely based my wedding um, themed around Beauty and the Beast as well so it holds a really special memory in my heart. Now my favourite smells is coffee, I just love the smell of coffee. I never used to drink coffee a lot, I don't like to drink it too much because I sort of get a little bit jittery and I don't really like it, but I have got a favourite coffee place which is called Le Vintage Sandwich Boutique here near where I live and they make amazing coffee and I just love the smell. My favourite sort of coffee is a vanilla latte, I get that every single time. And my other favourite smell is this particular perfume here. This is uh, by a brand called Toka and this is their Cleopatra smell. This is a very expensive perfume. I think in Australia this retails for like $90 so yeah crazy expensive but I got this for my wedding a couple of years ago and I absolutely love it. I love smelling it. It sort of triggers memories for me. I love when smells trigger, trigger memories and yeah one of my you know favorite memories in my entire life is my wedding day so I'm so glad that I've got this to sort of remember it by and I think I'm gonna spray some now. Oh, it just smells so good. It's really like floral but not being over the top and I find it lasts really well as well. One of my favorite feelings is feeling warm. I just love feeling nice and snuggly and cozy. I hate feeling cold. I feel the cold really, really easy. So right now, if I can get my leg up high enough, I am wearing these slippers here. These are from a shop called uh, Peter Alexander. So they're nice bright pink slippers and they're all covered in, on the inside with uh, sheep's wool, which keeps my feet nice and toasty and warm. I love reading books. I've always loved reading books, but my favorite sort of genre is fantasy novels. So so your Harry Potters and things like that. Um, what else have I read? I really like the Green Rider series. That's a series I'm currently reading at the moment. So anything to do with fantasy and yeah, just that sort of, you know, supernatural sort of world kind of thing I've always been drawn to. Um, and yeah, it's always in other aspects of my life as well. I seem to be drawn to things like that. But books in general, I just love curling up on the couch, especially on a nice rainy day and just having and getting lost in a really, really good book. Now this is a bit of a strange one, but I really love feeling clean. Like, not that I'm like dirty all the time, but you know when you haven't, well this is me anyway, when you haven't had time to wash your hair or you just haven't been bothered to wash your hair because it takes time, you know, and you get in the shower and you have a really good hair wash and then I always do a body scrub as well and I just get out of the shower and I feel so refreshed and so clean and I just feel like new again. And the shampoo and conditioner that I'm loving at the moment is by uh, OGX. It's the shampoo and conditioner which is the weightless hydration coconut water conditioner and shampoo. I really like these because they are really weightless hydration. Um, I do have curly hair which is prone to frizz so this really helps to uh, calm that frizz and keep my curls in place and I really like that the shampoo was like a gel sort of formula but then the conditioner is a nice creamy one and these were they are a little bit more expensive. They're about $17 or $18 a bottle, but I do have short hair, so I've had these for a fair few weeks now and I've barely made a dent in either of them. And the scrub that I always love to use, and I have mentioned this in a few favorites videos before. I'm sorry about the packaging. It's really gross. I'm nearly out of this. And it's really well loved. This is the Frank body scrub. This is the original one. And the reason I love this so much is because it smells like coffee. So it's just such a nice scrub. It looks and smells like coffee, uh, ground coffee beans. You just scrub it all over your body. It just gets rid of all those dead skin cells, makes you feel fresh and clean and just, 
yeah, it leaves like a nice oil on your skin as well. So it's really good for winter to get rid of that dry skin, um, but still keep yourself moisturized as well. So definitely love that and I need to order some more. Now my favorite time of the day is, this happens more in spring or the end of summer, heading into autumn. It's around four to five o'clock in the afternoon. The sun's just starting to go down. It's still slightly warm, but it's, it's starting to cool down and you can just take a nice walk and the lighting is just perfect. And I just feel so content and happy this time of day. And it's normally when I take my dog for a walk. Um, so it makes it even better just spending time with him and my husband and just enjoying those moments in, that after, in the afternoon and that time of day and I just can't wait for the summer months to come back so I can enjoy that time again. Now, don't get me wrong, I love makeup. I love wearing makeup. It's a huge part of my YouTube channel, but I love no makeup days. They're, I always try and have one a week and I really look forward to it every week. Just to have nothing on my face, it does wonders for my skin. And just to feel like I don't have to worry about how my makeup looks, if I need to blot or powder, if my mascara is smudging or I've got red lipstick all over my teeth. It's so nice just to take it all off, not have to worry about it. I don't really do much to my hair on those days either and just feel just clean and pure and yeah it feels really nice and on those days one of my favorite things to do is hang out in my pajamas and then sitting on the couch and binge watching a tv series for the entire day so for one of my days off every weekend that's what I like to do and normally it's the vampire diaries and now that I've finished that I need to find something else to watch but binge watching in your pajamas on the couch no makeup hair a mess best feeling in the world. Now I am an early riser. I do like to start the day nice and early and I never used to be, but now that I work in an industry that requires me to get up nice and early, on my days off, I'm up early regardless. And I find I like to get up early because you can just achieve so much more out of the day. And normally I start my day with yoga. I absolutely love yoga. Um, and I use the YouTube channel Yoga with Adrian. I just do it at home on my own. She's so great at just explaining everything and the sensations and how you're supposed to be feeling while doing each yoga pose. And I've really noticed a difference in my energy, the way my strength in my body and just how I feel about myself. It's a really great way for me to start my day, clears my head, clears my mind, makes me just feel ready for the day. And I just feel happier. It gets the blood flowing and my energy going. And yeah, I just absolutely love it. And another workout that I really love is Zumba. So that is like a real good all over body workout gets the sweat going. I sweat like crazy during my Zumba classes. Um, I do Zumba with Cass. I will leave her Facebook page below. If you do live in the Gold Coast area, you should definitely give her a uh, class a try. I've been with her for nearly five years now. and She has been going for a very long time. She is incredible and I can't imagine going to any other Zumba instructor but her. All right guys, so that is it for this monthly favorites video. They're just a few of my favorite things. I really hope you enjoyed it. Give it a big thumbs up if you did. It was a little bit different, but I really enjoyed making it. And I hope you guys got to know me a little bit better. Leave any questions in the comment box below. Anything else that you'd like to know about me, I'll be happy to answer. And don't forget to subscribe so you don't miss any more videos. Have a wonderful day, be beautiful, and I will see you next time. Bye.